Ace of Cups is here. This Ace of Cups is all about, you know, taking care of yourself, loving yourself. Um, someone that's very blessed. And this could be somebody that's in their emotions crying a lot as well. Yeah. Yeah, I'm hearing this. This could be somebody that you don't know or somebody that did something to you. They cry a lot. Yeah, the moon card is here. They're in fear about something. They did something secretly, the moon card. Yeah, they're in fear and they're crying a lot. They could have been playing with spell work. And um, it's because somebody walked away from them. Maybe you walked away from them or other people just start walking away from them. Eight of Cups looking at them as toxic. Because they were doing a lot of stuff in secret. And they're in fear of whatever that they were doing to you. And it has them in their emotions. Ace of Cups is here. Yeah. They're in fear. A lot of people are walking away from them, Eight of Cups, and they don't understand why. It's because of whatever that they were sitting back doing in secret. Yeah, the chariot is here. People are moving forward from this person after gaining truth and clarity. They're finally moving on from this person. This could have been somebody that you had not walked away from. And these are people that they were still attached to. Now they're seeing this person for who they are. And they're walking away from them too. You have the star card is here. They see you in this star energy. Someone that's a healer. Someone that's spiritually woke. You attract a lot of attention in a positive way. You pour out love to yourself and other people too. You're someone that was destined for success, destined to help people heal, help people get woke, spiritually teach people. These people look at you as somebody that's like a star. Someone that's very blessed and protected and anointed. And they see why you moved on from that person. You've only grown. You've only prospered. Yeah, the Queen of Cups is here. You're someone that's very loving and caring. You take care of your kids. You're very emotionally mature and balanced. You're a very mature person. And you always, you know, pouring out love to people. Caring for people. No matter who it is, that's just who you are. The energy that you walk in. Eight of Swords and Four of Cups. This person felt rejected by you in some type of way with this Four of Cups. You rejected this person, didn't want to be around this person anymore, didn't want to connect with this person. And um, they wanted you to be stuck. Eight of Swords is here in a self-made prison. Because they were stuck. So they thought they would have you stuck. You were possibly the only person that really showed genuine love to this person. And once you started rejecting them, they wanted you to be stuck. They started doing stuff in secret because you had them walked away. And now they're in fear and sitting back crying as a lot of other people are walking away. <laughs> you get what you put out. You have four of pentacles this year. They were trying to hold on to all these people with it, like it was everything that they had. And they thought they would hold on to these people by, you know, trying to secretly do stuff to you. To have you and your emotions. It did not work. They ended up getting stuck. Eight of Swords is here. Bonnie, blinded, and tied up. For death, that's all. And they're being rejected by these people. The same way you rejected them. And these people started, you know, figuring out why you rejected them. Why you walked away from this person. And they started walking away from this person too. They realized this person was only trying to keep them stuck. And hold on to them. To keep them stuck. Yeah, Knight of Swords is here. This person always got a lot of, you know, is always angry with this Knight of Swords. They always spreading lies and gossip and slander on people. It's like every time they came around this person, they realized the only reason why 
they would be attached to this person, four of pentacles and knight of swords. They were only being attached to this person to meet up, to gossip about people, and that was it. And they were just, you know, stuck to that person with that energy, and that was the eight of swords. And now this person is secretly in their emotions because they started walking away from them. Looked at them as toxic. These same, the same person that you walked away from, now their friends are walking away from them and look at them as toxic. <laughs> look at them as somebody that sat back and spread lies, rumors, and gossip and wanted to try to have you stuck and was literally thinking that they were going to come in at the Knight of Swords, talk about you bad, and keep them stuck. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. They realized this person was just slowing them down. Slowing their finances down. Slowing down all movements in their life. And that was it. <laughs> yeah, they look at this person as somebody. That's why their finances come in slow. It's because of the energy that they walk in. And they were only slowing them down. Yeah, this person always got a lot of fights, arguments, drama, and conflict and chaos going on. Secretly trying to one-up a person. Secretly trying to be a person. Secretly trying to be you. It's like whoever these friends is, these are people that got behind the scenes with this person that you walked away from that was secretly trying to, um, you know, do stuff to you because they seen you in this star energy. They seen you on the chariot moving forward in life. And they seen you walking away from all toxicity. And they got behind the scene. Then they seen you in this Queen of Cups energy just taking care of you and your kids, focused on you and your kids. And you were rejecting everybody else. Four of Cups is here. Next thing you know, they want to have you stuck at the Eight of Swords. Thought they would send a lot of conflict, drama, and chaos to you. With these same people. These people ended up getting going through chaos, drama, and conflict. And they realized why they were at the Eight of Swords stuck. Constantly going through this Five of Wands energy. And they seen that this person was secretly competing with you. These are friends of a person that you hadn't cut off or walked away from because they were toxic. And they secretly wanted you to, you know, be in your emotions because they were secretly emotions in their emotions because you walked away from them. They were feeling some type of way because you were attracting a lot of attention in a positive way. You were healing and getting spiritually woke and spiritually teaching yourself and other people. You were on the chariot and had control of your own life and this person didn't. This person was sitting back at the eight of swords stuck. Binded, blinded, and tied up and thought they would, you know, keep other people stuck as they came in quick at the Knight of Swords with gossip, slander, and rumors and lies on you. And they would hold on to them people. They couldn't even hold on to them people. They couldn't even hold on to you. These people that they were sitting back trying to hold on to as they gossiped about you, they started rejecting this person for a cup. They look at this person as somebody that was at the five of ones competing with you secretly and wanted to be you. They couldn't understand why this person could not keep their mouth off of you. Yeah, five of cups is here. They were in regret, ashamed, embarrassed. They didn't want to be around that person. It's like every time they connected with that person, they were talking about you in a negative way. And they realized that they would, that person was just keeping them stuck. They would meet up and just talk about you. And it just caused them to walk away from this person. They look at this person as somebody that's, you know, a non-believer. They don't believe in God. You could have been somebody that was, you know, always talking about God, always spiritually, you know, healing people and helping people, giving, you know, spiritual quotes. You were doing something online with this star card where you were attracting a lot of attention. And this person is somebody that don't believe in God. So they could have sat back and tried to blaspheme you. Didn't want people to know that you believed in God or didn't want people to think that you believed in God. They were jealous of you. These people are so ashamed. Whoever these people is that, you know, they were trying to send conflict with to you. They're in conflict with. They don't even want to be around that person. They're in regret for even getting behind the scenes listening to that person. Because they they didn't do nothing. Experience this five of wands energy and that was it. Yeah, a five of swords is here. They look at that person as somebody that was jealous of you, envious of you, hating on you. Wanted to try to sabotage you and win at all costs to secretly defeat you. Because this person is really scared of you. And they didn't want them to know. So it's like these, whoever these people is that were friends, they realized that they were only holding on to this person to be stuck to an energy that's jealous of you, envious of you, and wanted to beat you. Envious of who you are just overall, you know, as a person.
Yeah, Seven of Cups is here. They look at this person as somebody that's very confused. In a confused mindset. They can't stop getting high, getting drunk. Casting confusion around different people. A lot of people were confused. They feel like this person didn't do nothing but sit back and confuse them where they couldn't move forward in life. If they wanted to do anything or set any goals, they want to keep them under them. Want to make it seem like we should get together and do this and that. And they'll come up with the idea but want this person to be working for them or to make it seem like they were under them. And that didn't work. It's like now this person is sitting back confused. In fear. Because everything they had a setback and secretly did to you, it's causing a lot of people to walk away from them and it's causing them to not have anything. They're being rejected everywhere, they're go everywhere they go. If they apply for a job, that's being rejected. If they apply for, you know, different stuff, it's being rejected. Whatever they get, it's, being, it's coming in little by little and just being snatched from them over and over again. And they're back out here trying to get it. Yeah, they're at the Seven of Cups of Fuse. How are you sitting in your Ten of Pentacles? Creating generational wealth. Because you, you chose to, you know, mind your business and do you. You chose to walk in this star energy. You chose to keep moving forward even after they were secretly with this moon car. Trying to, you know, do stuff to try to keep you stuck. Eight of Swords is here. With multiple people that, as lies were told on to you, Nine of Swords. Just to try to hold on to you in some type of way, your energy. And it didn't work. They thought they would gang up people five or ones to play in your energy to talk about you in a negative way. And these people didn't do nothing but get karma. Stuff starts slowing down for them and they were confused that stuff was speeding up for you. Ten of Pentacles is here. Yeah, Two of Cups. And King of Swords. Yeah, it was like whoever this person is, this two of cups, this person you're supposed to partner up with or you could have been partnering up with, working with. And um, these are two people that will be coming together to express the way they feel as well. You know, have love for each other. And um, whoever this person is, is a, is a king of swords. They know the truth. Yeah, they're in this king of swords energy. Yeah, I'm here. They're in this King of Swords energy. Yeah, and then King of Pentacles. So it's like, um, they cut off a lot of people as well. They could have been going through the same thing, whoever this Two of Cups energy is. And um, they cut off people, King of Swords, and then King of Pentacles is here to start focusing on their finances, start focusing on their um, stability, their health. Yeah. Yeah. It's like they're in regret because whatever they were doing in secret, it didn't work. It just caused people to walk away from them. You've manifested this Two of Cups energy. This is someone that, you know, you're going to partner up with. <clears throat> you're going to be able to work with this person. You're going to have, you know, a ten of pentacles with this person. Creating generational wealth. <clears throat> and this person is someone, you know, that business oriented, money oriented with this king of pentacles. Someone that take care of their self. They're, you know, they're into learning about, you know, different ways to keep their self up health, health wise. This person is a, queen, a king of swords as well. They know when to cut people off, they no longer serve purpose in their life. And this is the same. It's like they knew that you, why you cut off certain people or this person. But it's like after you cut this person off, a lot of other people started, you know, seeing the truth for what it was. This person is hateful. Five of swords. This person is jealous. Five of wands. This person is secretly trying to copy somebody and they, they're confused. They realize why you cut this person off, whoever friends of uh, these, of this person's was. They were in regret for even meeting up with this person and listening to whatever they had to say. Yeah, Three of Cups is here. They were in regret for kicking it with this person and partying and celebrating. 
These are friends of theirs. This is how, you know, whoever this person that you walked away from, they were secretly in their feelings. And they wanted you to be in your feelings. Because they felt some type of way because you walked away from them for being toxic. Their friends are in regret. They're sitting back at the five of cups, embarrassed, ashamed. Five of cups, five of wands, and five of swords. And, um... It's like that was the only reason why they were connected. And they realized that and they cut that person off. But I'm hearing this person, yeah, three of swords is here. They were depressed. They were only going through depression, heartbreak, heartaches. This person has sit, been sitting back at the three of swords depressed since you cut them off. And now they're sitting back depressed because whoever these friends is, three of cups and three of swords, they cut them off too. They don't want nothing to do with them either. They haven't seen this person for who they are and they don't even, you know, communicate with that person like that. They look at this person as somebody that's jealous of you. Wanted to be you. Yeah, the world card is here. You completed a cycle with that person and they did too. You walked into a whole nother cycle and th this is why this person was jealous of you. Because you're someone that don't need anyone. And you never did. This person is somebody that's very needy. They got to, you know, they like to hold on to people, cling on to people. You're someone that's very genuine and pure. The world card is here. And you don't have to hold on to anyone. You don't have to sit back and talk about people in a negative way to, you know, get people to celebrate with you, kick it with you, or, you know, just listen to what you got to say. This is the type of energy that this person was in. And they, you know, being looked at as somebody that's, Envious, jealous, self-sabotaging. Wanted to secretly copy you and be you. Wanted to secretly look like you and talk like you and it didn't work. He said, this had these people in regret. Yeah, four of wands is here. You're someone that's very grounded and stable. You have a happy, you know, family life. This person was mad about the way you carry yourself. How stable you were. You're, you're someone that has stability. And they were mad about that. Could have been the way you kept your house. They didn't like that because they didn't keep their house like that. It was just something petty and this was all a secret. They were just feeling some type of way. Way before you walked away from them, they would come up in your house and feel some type of way. And you didn't, you didn't even know. It was a secret. <laughs> this petty and jealous and envious. And you just cut this person out. Yeah, the hangman is here. They're stuck in the hangman position. They're stuck in some type of situation. They could have tried to do something to have you stuck in some type of situation. And this was a secret. Um, they're sitting back in a hangman position. You know, just sit, sit back, racking up some type of time with this hangman. And they didn't know. Racking up karma. Yeah. King of Cups is here. Yeah, King of Cups is in a hangman position. Whoever this person is that they didn't want to come towards you, this Two of Cups energy, they're stuck on you. King of, Cups, King of Cups and the Hangman is here. This person is stuck on you. And they're sitting back at the Three of Swords, heart broke, depressed, stressed out. Because they thought they were going to rile up some friends and they were gonna, you were going to be the topic of their conversation. And these friends were in regret as they realized they didn't have nothing to offer their self as they stayed in that person's energy. They met up to talk about you and celebrate and kicking and party. As you're sitting in your ten of pentacles. And they're getting rejected everywhere they go as they were attached to that energy. Yeah, Queen of Wands is here. They seen you in this Queen of Wands energy. Very attractive. Very, you know, passionate. Going after whatever it is you want out of life and leading your own life. Setting goals for yourself and chasing after your goals. Someone that's very gifted and intuitive. Someone that's very confident. Your self-esteem is very high and theirs were low. Yeah, five of pentacles is here. These are people that you were, this person was somebody you were supposed to leave out in the cold. They are five of pentacles, spiritual disgrace, always experiencing financial lacks. 
They don't even know how to, you know, fend for their self or get anything. This person don't even want to work. If they get a job, they cannot keep a jo job for so long. Because they just want to sit down and not do much, you know, to get, get whatever they can. And that's it. And they always end up out in the cold. Five of Pentacles is here. Physically, mentally, and spiritually out in the cold. Just lost. Trying to get other people to help them find their way. And they don't realize they place this Five of Pentacles energy on their self. Trying to sit back and do stuff to you secretly. Because you walked away. Yeah, Nine of Swords is here. They're sitting back stressed out in a mental prison in their head. As a lot of people are gossiping about them. They can't even sleep at night. A lot of people that they used to get together and talk about you with. Or talk about you too. They're sitting around. You know, they're getting behind the scenes talking about this person to their friends or their family. And spreading all of this person's secrets that they wanted to keep hidden about you. The lies and stuff that they spread on you. They're, you know, contacting different people and telling them how dirty they did you. All because they was jealous of you, hating on you, and wanted to be you. Yeah, the fool card is here. All because you took a leap of faith towards a whole new path. And this person got that mad and was hating on you. Because they could not be you. And now all their friends is talking, you know, talking to different family members and different friends that that person don't know. And they're exposing that person. Talking about how dirty this person did you because they was, you know, secretly in competition with you and you didn't even know. Yeah, they're talking about, they, they're basically letting it be known why you cut this person off. Queen of Swords is here. That you spoke the truth about this person, you cut them off because they no longer serve purpose in your life. And they're, you know, telling these different people why they cut them off. They cut them off because of how they did you. 